In 2002 Toronto, 13-year-old Maylin Lee, who lives with her parents, Ming and Jean, helps take care of the family's temple dedicated to their ancestor Sun Yi, and works to make her mother proud. She hides her personal interests from Ming, such as the fact that she and her friends Miriam, Priya, and Abby are fans of the boy band Four Town. One night when Ming, who is strict and overprotective, discovers May's crush on Devon, the local convenience store clerk, she inadvertently humiliates May in public. That night, May has a vivid nightmare involving red pandas. When she wakes up the next morning, she has transformed into a large red panda. She hides from her parents and discovers that she transforms only when she is in a state of high emotion. When she reverts to human form her hair remains red, and so she goes to school in a 2K. Ming initially believes Mei is experiencing her first period, but learns the truth when she humiliates her at school, causing Mei to transform and run home in panic and tears. Ming and Jean explain that Sun Yi was granted this transformation to protect her daughters and her village during wartime, and that all her female descendants have also had this ability. This has become inconvenient and dangerous in modern times, so the red panda spirit must be sealed in a talisman by a ritual on the night of a lunar eclipse, which will take place in a month's time. May's friends discover her transformation, but take a liking to it. May finds that concentrating on them enables her to control her transformations. Ming allows May to resume her normal life, but refuses to let May attend for town's upcoming concert. Instead, the girls secretly raise money for the tickets at school by exploiting the popularity of May's red panda form while lying to Ming about how May is spending her time. To raise the last $100, May agrees to attend school bully Tyler's birthday party as the Red Panda. At the party, May is upset to discover that the concert will be on the night she is to undergo the ritual. In her rage, she attacks Tyler when he insults her family, frightening the other kids. Ming discovers May's activities and accuses her friends of corrupting and taking advantage of her. Ashamed of her actions and afraid to stand up to her mother, May fails to come to her friend's defense. To Ming's dismay, May's grandmother and aunts arrive to assist with May's ritual. As May prepares herself, Jean finds videos she recorded of herself as the red panda with her friends and tells her she should not be ashamed of this side of her, but to embrace it. During the ritual, as May's red panda form is about to be sealed, she decides to keep her powers and abandons the ritual to attend the concert at the Sky Dome. In making her escape, she breaks Ming's talisman, releasing her red panda form as well. At the concert she reconciles with her friends and discovers that Tyler is also a four-town fan. However, an enraged Ming, having become a kaiju-sized red panda, disrupts the concert, intending to take Mei back by force. Mei 
Mei and Ming argue about the former's independence. As they quarrel, Mei accidentally knocks her mother unconscious. Mei's grandmother and aunts break their talismans to use their red panda forms to help drag Ming into a new ritual circle. <laughs> Mei's friends in Four Town join in singing to complete the ritual, sending Mei, Ming, and the other women to the astral plane. Mei reconciles with her mother. She helps her mend her bond with her own mother, whom Ming accidentally scarred in anger before her own red panda form was sealed. The other women contain their red pandas in new talismans, but Mei decides to keep hers, and Ming accepts that she is finding her own path. Later, as the Li family raises money to repair the damage to the Sky Dome, Mei and Ming's relationship has improved. Mei balances her temple duties, where her red panda is now an attraction, with spending time with her friends, who now include Tyler. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please make sure to leave a like, subscribe to the channel and click the bell icon to be notified of future videos. Till the next one, bye.